If you're anything like me, I'm always looking for free performance on my laptop. Because if there's a method that I can do to get free performance, you better bet your bottom dollar I'm going to be doing that method. So in today's video, I'll be having a look at Game Boy Presence Writer on versus Game Boy Presence Writer off. And I think you'd all be pleasantly surprised that there's free performance for you on the table. So sit down, strap in, let's go. Alright guys, before we get started with Game Boy Presence Writer, please head to my channel. If you haven't subscribed as of yet, please consider doing so. And then for my regular members that watch my videos, um, I added a member section as of yesterday, so please consider joining. Level 1 is badges and emojis and membership exclusive videos. Level 2 is 24-7 support, which you can access via my Discord server via Level 2. But, let's get to the video. So guys, what is Game Boy Presence Writer? When you go to your Windows settings and gaming, uh, most people tell you to switch off the Xbox Game Boy, myself included. So you switch off the Xbox Game Boy, Xbox Networking, and then in Windows Services, you can disable all the uh, Xbox related services. But if you do that and you don't explicitly disable Game Boy Presence Writer, every time you start a game, and you go to the task manager you see a game ball presence writer is going to open up in the background and it's actually going to eat some of your system performance so i have done a couple of videos where i show you to disable this but they've been in a bigger uh, uh, gpu optimization video so some of you might have missed it so there is another method to do it but the easiest way is just to install when error tweaker and then what you do is you just scroll down to context menu i'm not going to go into all the other details scroll into the context menu and you see uh, take ownership you just add take ownership to the context menu so once you've done that you head over to windows and then you look for system 32 there we go system 32 now these are all system protected files and applications but because we've done take ownership, now we can actually modify these files. So now what you're going to be looking for is Game Boy Presence Writer. See, I've already changed it. But what you're going to do is you're just going to right click on it. And then say take ownership. And then just click any key. And now you can modify this. So what you do is you just add a 1, 2, 3 at the end. So every time you launch a game, Game Boy Presence Writer won't be able to launch in the background. Because it's got a different uh, executable name now so guys you're going to be saving a little bit of performance so the other day i compared the previous driver versus the latest driver but i didn't actually know i actually did a dism system uh health check and a system restore for a video that i was planning to do and in the in doing that whole process i actually re-enabled game Boy presence writer so my stats for 531.79 were actually skewed a little bit. Um, so in today's video, what I've done is I compared Game Boy Presence Writer on, which is the same as uh, the results I got for the other day with Game Boy Presence Writer running in the background. And then I did that whole process where I disabled Game Boy Presence Writer. And guys, what you can actually see is with Game Boy Presence Writer on, when you add up all the average FPSs, you get to a total FPS over 9 games of 598, divide that by 9, and your average FPS is 66.44. For the 1% lows, you do the same, add it up, get to 448, and then divide that by 9, and your average 1% low is 49.78. And then when you divide the 1% lows by the average FPS, the stability would be 74.92. That's for the latest driver with Game Boy Presence Writer on. When you disable Game Boy Presence Writer, I do the same thing. I add up all my average FPSs over 9 games. My total FPS is 596. When I divide that by 9, my average FPS per game is 66.33. And then I add up all the 1% lows, and that gives me a total 1% low over 9 games of 454. Divide that by 9, and you'll see my 1% lows actually rose to 50.44. So it's quite a, quite a nice little boost in performance there. So when I divide the 1% lows by the average FPS, 
you see my stability here is 66 uh, 76.04 which you can see is one and a quarter percent higher than when you don't when you have game ball presence right to enable so guys you're going to be raising your one percent lows it's not really going to affect your average fps but your one percent lows will actually be going up and that is why i recommend disabling game ball presence writer guys thank you so much for watching as mentioned before if you haven't subscribed yet now's the time to do so if you enjoyed this video be sure to smash that like button um yet again guys channel members if you enjoy my content please consider joining my channel other than that guys have a good day it's people like you cheers mm -hmm.